Hi, it's Alaska Granny. If you're looking for an appetizer that's simple, easy, and outstanding, and will make your friends and family crave the flavor, then you want to try Broccoli Rob Crostini with a pepper oil, and it's so simple to make. There are three things you need to do to begin. Put a big pot of water on to boil, and then you take another pot and put cold, icy water in it. Then you're going to rinse your broccoli raw and trim off the bottom few inches. Now you're going to plunge these into the boiling water and cook them for three minutes until they're bright green. Then you quickly remove them and place them into the ice cold water to stop the cooking. Once your water comes to a full rolling boil, salt it aggressively, add your broccoli raw and cook it for about three minutes. You'll know it's done because it'll turn bright green and it'll be fork tender. Don't overcook it. Have your ice bath ready to plunge it in and cool it immediately. It's been about three, three and a half minutes. It's fork tender and I want to immediately plunge it into the ice water to stop the cooking. Drain it well and let it cool. My broccoli rabe is cooled and drained. I cut up a few cloves of garlic, and now I'm gonna chop this up into about half inch pieces. The best part of the broccoli rabe is the florette end. So make sure you get all of that that you can. If any of the stock is still hard, you can discard that. Next, I'm gonna put it into a bowl with two tablespoons of olive oil, two tablespoons of red wine vinegar, a half a teaspoon of oregano and ample salt and pepper to taste. Stir it all together, place it in the refrigerator for an hour up to overnight and it'll be ready to go. While the topping is resting in the fridge, I'm going to prepare the bread. I like to take an equal part mix of melted butter and olive oil with some salt and pepper and I brush it on. Then I'm going to place it on the grill it gives it a much better flavor than just warming it in the oven, which is more like toast. This grilled bread makes it extra special. bread is done being grilled, I'm going to assemble my broccoli rabe crostini. So take a piece of your grilled bread and a nice spoonful of your broccoli rabe mixture. Pile it right onto your bread. Then you take, as my son calls it, the undisputed king of cheese, Parmigiano Reggiano, and grate it right over the top. And there you are. Doesn't that look delicious? And it's so simple and everyone will just be amazed at how delicious it is. Learn more at alaskagranny.com. Please subscribe to the Alaska Granny channel.